Hi guys, Marshall here with this week's Sally Kitchen. This week we're going to talk about doubts. <clears throat> we're probably going to be talking about them for a bit because I'm kind of fascinated with them right now. So doubts are these things that we think are facts about reality, about circumstances, about something, some subject, or topic. So these limit our ability to see change in our lives. They limit our ability to actually receive something different. They limit our ability to even think differently. So, and that's important because if we're trying to grow out of a pattern that we don't prefer or like, if we have doubts, we're not going to get out of it. They trap us in there real quick. They utterly negate our magic per se. They, they stop us from stepping out of the normal and taking risks to learn, to discover, and to create. So what doubt are you holding on to today that you use to justify your limited thinking about whatever? Now, it's kind of a complicated question. Think about it. How are you using doubt to justify your limited beliefs? How are you using doubt to limit yourself, to limit your happiness, to limit your uh, success, to limit your wealth, to limit your peace, to limit your love? How are you using doubt to protect your comfort zone? Think about these things over the next week. Share below what you find in these things because I want to know. I want to see where you're at with it. Personally, I've used doubts to minimize my exposure in my business, to minimize the threat of uh, responsibility, um, taking on more, doing more, being more. Um, I've used doubt to limit relationships, to limit uh, business opportunities, to limit action. And when I start changing my attitude towards doubt by seeing it as a doubt, framing it up as an assumption, and then giving myself permission to take it on anyway, to, to discover what's the truth in this circumstance, that's when things have changed for me. And that's where they'll change for you if you take the risk to start challenging your doubts, detecting them, challenge them, and uproot them. So let me know how this works for you. Uh, thanks for being part of my community and share this video with people you think would benefit from it and put this to work and we'll talk next week okay thank you guys have a great day